My name is Elena Capra. I'm an interior designer and I own my own design firm, Elena Capra Designs. I've been living in this condo, this is 12 years now, which sounds crazy, but um, it's seen a lot of changes. Currently, you're looking at the most recent design. <laughs> when I think about the one thing that I haven't really worked on in here is the lighting. But that's where I've been struggling and I really want to do something to brighten up the space. One of the greatest things about lighting is that it's one of the only design elements that long after the room is designed, the paint is dry, the furniture is in, you can still sort of change that and tweak it to really create a better ambiance in the room. If you have to modify or make something a little warmer in tone or a little cooler in tone, you can do that. And that's what's so great about lighting. My friend Mike works in the industry. He works with Philips Hue, and he suggested that in order to really brighten up the space and do better lighting options, that I look into the Philips Hue Smart Lighting Collection. And he offered to stop by and help me set it all up. Hey Mike, how are you? Good, Come how are in. you? The Hue portfolio is actually a really large portfolio. We have a light fixture for almost every single space of the home. So that also means we have some, some bulbs, but also non-bulbs and fixtures. And so that's what I came here to help kind of show her some of the new intricacies of the system that she was not well aware of. Let's take a closer look at the style and layout of my space to determine my home's lighting needs. So this is the dining room area. It's kind of situated right by the window, so I love that there's natural light, but I also like to be able to get great lighting when I'm having a meal in the evening. So I also sometimes do work here, so it also needs a function as a workspace as well, which is why I like good light. Since I don't have recessed ceiling lighting in the main living area, the ability to be able to control different levels of light and have some lamps here, a ceiling fixture here, another lamp over by the sofa, allows me to kind of pick and select the kind of lighting mood I want, whether it's in the daytime and I want some brighter light for, say, doing work, or if it's in the evening and I want it to be a little bit more dim and cozy. So while I did the best that I could with the lighting in the room, I tried to spread out, you know, kind of layer the lighting and have it in different areas to make the room more cohesive. But there's definitely a lot of room for improvement. So I'm looking forward to kind of making some changes and getting a better output of light and some more convenience with the lighting in the space. So most people will get started with you with one of our starter kits. It comes with everything you need to get started for one room get that set up, and if you like it, then extend to the next room, to the next room, to the next room. But Elena, she didn't want to just do one room of the home, she wanted to do her entire home at the same time. So I opened up all the boxes, got started in the process, screwed in all the new light bulbs, changed them all out, plugged in the router to the bridge, downloaded the app, and within seconds, at my fingertips, I had this amazing system to change out all the different hues of lighting in my home. What's really cool with the Hue system is not only does it have different shades of white light, but also has full color spectrum as well with 16 million colors. And what Paint With Light allows you to do is to really transform that space. So now not just helping you wake up or helping you go to sleep, but now it really kind of allows you to express yourself. So whether you want to have the whole room red for a nice party that you're having or holiday season, you know, turn it to colors of blue, um, you can really pick and choose whatever you want to do with the space. And again, transform it just with lighting alone. Whether it's your app or through your voice, it really allows you to have that fun experience with lights. Now lighting is as simple as telling, you know, Google or Alexa or Siri, turn my lights on or turn my lights off. This is honestly one of the coolest things. So easy to set up and so many options. From a design standpoint, lighting is one of the most important things in the space. Good lighting makes or breaks the look of a room and the feel of a room. Sometimes you really want that right ambiance in the space and that is controlled by the right lighting. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.